This is part two of my vintage refurbish. In this video, I am sealing off these cute two twin chairs that I am going to put eventually in my future nursery. Toddlers are going to be sitting in them, so I want them sealed really good. In part one, I showed you how to use Easy Off Oven Spray to strip the finish off the chairs. So I did do that and I will link that process down below. And I also did it a second time on the seats. So that has already been done. The only difference that I did the second time was I did not use the water hose to spray them off. I used a wash rag with water on it. So that was the only difference. I did not want the wood to be exposed to more water. This process is definitely for vintage refurbishes. Sometimes the water will leave cracks in your furniture. And I like that because as you will see, when I put finish on it, it makes the cracks darker. So you will see at the end what I'm talking about. And I'm going to do a before and after, so stay tuned. Here's the finish I am going to be using today. It's Flat Out Flat Top Coat by General Finishes. It is supposed to give that natural wood look without darkening it too much. So Flat Out Flat is not supposed to darken your furniture further. It's just supposed to bring out the natural colors. Okay, I got this different size sponge pack from the Dollar Tree and I am gonna use the small for the little crevices and the big one for the overall general part of the chair. Take this time to subscribe down below. Not only is it free, but you will be notified when the next video comes out if you hit that notification bell. I didn't use no specific technique for this. I just put it on the sponge and I smeared it on the chair. I did use this small sponge for all the little crevices and I made sure that there was no standing liquid on the chair because that can make other spots darker. Y'all, leave a comment down below. I would love to hear from you. If you don't leave a comment, I do not know who is watching my video. The first one to leave a sincere comment down below about this video will have their comment pinned. This is a great way to grow your channel because everybody else will see your comment above all the others. So leave a good comment down below. Here are my two timeout twin chairs with the finish on and I'm loving it. It's a light brown color. I'm going to wait to see what it looks like dried. It might be a different color dried, might lighten on up a little bit. So stay tuned. I am loving all of the dark details on these chairs, like the little knobs on the chairs, they're darker than the rest of the chair. And I, I just really, really like that. See how they're darker and all the dark spots and the characteristics of the chair have stayed and I like a natural wood color. Before and afters coming up now. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. See y'all next time. 